Hello guys, this is my favorite pattern. I use this on a still water lake and reservoirs. Just a single fly on a point and works really well. I tie this one on size 12 long shank hook and thread is olive. As for the tail, I use two goose pikes, chartreuse color. If you catch them on the bend, split in apart on either side and lock them all the way and just smooth up the body. Make sure they're sitting okay. As for the body, as usual, I use this beading elastic one millimeter thick. And if you burn it one from one side and pinch it and stretch it, it thin it down nicely and then you can catch it. Great part, uh, great material and it, is, it makes a really nice body. I use this quite a lot. Adding some olive permanent marker on the body to make some strong olive color. Now bring it towards the eye by using touch and turn and lock it. Just leave enough space for the thorax. Once you lock it, I'm adding some malar. This is a flashback uh, UV malar and few strand about eight or ten olive pheasant tail if you catch them tipping forward the tip facing forward and our two strand of peacock hurl it's a nice color combination so just bring them forward lock them nicely and then split apart these points, tips, and then bring them on either side of the hook. Just make nice legs. Bring your pheasant tail, cover it, and flashback material. And finish off by making a nice and smooth head. Now on top, I'm going to add some more color onto the flashback. Just a bit of olive and red, just to give a little hot spot. And cover it with the UV raisins and cure it. Also a nail varnish to seal the head. This is a great pattern for lake and reservoir. Rep makes a nice olive nymph and catch a lot more fish. I hope you enjoy this video. Please do like and subscribe my channel.